but there's no shortage of like freakouts in a Costco or a Ralph's or a, mm. a TJ Maxx over people who feel like it's their right to shop in the private place without the mask. That's there. Is we're the- look heroes walk among us, and it takes <laughs> it takes a level of bravery to, to the, the Snyder cut is actually every mask. superhero not wearing a mask. <laughs> <laughs> Brave enough. Superman has his goatee back, but he's wearing a mask now, so you can't yeah. see it. Well, they take the mask down, and then the cat buttholes are just where their mouths are. <laughs> oh my god! I don't want that. Yeah, I, I think you know CDC guidelines dictate that. I think all three of you, uh, your facial hair, not good for the personal protective equipment. I you're, know. you're not PPE oh, certified. I didn't There's know. gaps because of the facial hair. The I didn't hair. hear so that. Really, you just gave me a reason to shave. Mustache is okay though, apparently. Uh, the mustache, I, it can be okay. I don't. I don't think you're supposed to. Know. Yeah, probably you if it's fucking. Who knows? Wow, just I didn't take know a trip that. to Costco, Kevin. <laughs> 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 I'll just have, have the boy guys, do all my shopping for me. Have you guys gone <laughs> to the store? Have you done? Because I was doing all delivery stuff for a long while, and then yeah, I started I, going for for my neighbor. I got I got family. I got people that I created with my body, and uh, I have to feed them. And so I've gone. I mean, average yeah. like. Eh, you know, yeah, I mean, to. I wasn't huh. gonna say it. You guys don't want to have to he- like. It's worse to have to hear about them wanting to eat than actually feeding them. <laughs> okay, um, that's fair. Uh, so I've had to go probably on average every two weeks, and it started out with a lot of anxiety at first, but now it's just kind of become the normal. And it's it's not it's not fun. It's you know you got to. One, you're worried about yourself, and then two, you're worried about everybody else that's there and who's who's doing it right. And then you get home, and it's not put the stuff away. It's take everything out one by one, sanitize the hell out of right. it. Purell and, deluge. Yeah. And, yeah. When you guys yep. start shopping for a family of four, you'll realize how much fucking food that is every two weeks. It's not fun. And for me, that should be any day now. I've got, mm-hmm. Alana's gonna about to pop, so... We're- <laughs> yeah, we're doing mostly the Amazon... Uh, Direct Amazon. <laughs> yeah, yeah I, was, I, I was Amazon Postmates, but I did like I went to the the, the old TJs. I saw what Joe was trading, and uh, I found people were way way more polite. Yeah, they're very nice. It. They're very nice. Yeah, yeah. And, it's and, way and, more and the arrows dictating where you go through the store. I'm like, I'm not mad at that, and mm-hmm. I don't need somebody breathing down my neck while I'm impulse buying, you know, gluten free gum. Uh, yeah. it's we fine that a, you're six feet away. When, I don't. When we, <laughs> When we were in Palm Springs, we, we went to a Walmart, and um, I have not been to a Walmart in quite some time, and that was awful. And it, it there well, was because a hamster. Because the prices were so low. The prices were so low. And I don't, it's disgusting. You, I don't like deals. I don't like saving money. Uh, um, have you seen how far they rolled them back? It's ridiculous. Oh, I don't like uh, savings yes, in my face. It's a Listen. little too far, is all I'm saying. Maybe <laughs> Whatever. Will- you... You can't beat the prices. They know what they're doing. Uh, but we walked in. Ruining communities. That's what they're doing <laughs> yeah. with their anti-competitive yeah. With their prices. precedence. Sorry. Yes. 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 sorry, sorry. They're helping working families lo- save money and lose jobs. It's, it all pays off. Now. Um, but the, uh, yeah, Kevin, just in. so you know, every time you get political, we fill your quadrant in with a commercial for the Snyder Cut. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, we've got almost all of Aquaman in there now. He's, um, we just need a little listen, bit more. <laughs> but listen, we, no, sorry, we walked in to the Walmart and there was a hamster uh, loose, and, <laughs> <laughs> and in a vest, and it was greeting you. But no, there was just <laughs> you're thinking of Ralph. Yeah, not Ralph. This was a Welcome full hamster, Walmart. and it was running around, and it looked like Instagram like leaked into Walmart because it was so cute and adorable and on its own just walked like jumping down the the thing and I was like I'm wearing a mask and everyone's staying socially distant and I was like I want to get this hamster like really bad like I want to kind (laughs) of hold this hamster and so I start going toward the hamster and then someone else comes and then social distancing I was like whoop and then this woman who was kind of let's say rough around the edges maybe a Walmart person if we're talking colloquially she grabbed the hamster and I was like dang I really wanted that and she ate it and I was yeah and then it occurred to me I was like I was under my mask I was like she took the hamster she took (laughs) the hamster 
<laughs> yeah, I wanted, really wanted to like pet that hamster. Like I haven't seen a hamster since like a kid, and I was so excited. But then we never saw the hamster again, and we never heard uh, the intercom uh, say that someone lost a hamster. And this and, was not this woman's hamster. And so this was a dream you had last night. <laughs> <laughs> so let's uh, let's Walmart this bat and roll it back a little bit. So. <laughs> Hamster. That's the end of the podcast. <laughs> hamster in Walmart because Walmart ain't selling hamsters. Means either that hamster was ferried in. Mm-hmm. This was a a hamster that got <laughs> like five one of those that feral that hamsters. Yeah. yeah, feral hamster out on the lamb got out and like traveled outside of the house. Or went to pet, Walmart. Pe- yeah, PetSmart next door. That there should not be a hamster. What the how is there a hamster? M- my first thought was that they that Walmart must sell hamsters. Uh, and then Grace was like, Walmart doesn't sell hamsters. And I was like, yeah, of course Walmart doesn't sell hamsters. I know that. I was just <laughs> Is there a, a chance, I, I think that, that it grew up in Walmart and there's a Walmart <laughs> hamster. <laughs> That's the mayor of Walmart. He's That's a little... the mayor of Walmart. <laughs> you found the underground inside the wall society of Walmart and you took their mayor. <laughs> Is it possible, Elliot? Like Is the there a chance? <laughs> Is there a chance that that was not a hamster? That was going to be my question. Like, maybe it was like, uh, you know, pizza rat's adorable. Could it have been um, some other sort of vermit that maybe had its uh, tail cropped or cut off? Guys, run listen. over by a shopping cart. Listen to me. Picture the cutest hamster you've ever seen in your like whole life. Like a little teddy bear hamster. Right. And then, but all around it, Walmart. That's what this was. This so, was this was like a pure. This should this should have been a hamster at like a hamster show, like a dog show, but for hamsters. It was a perfect hamster. It looked like it did its hair that morning. It I mean, I, so I I have a I have an issue with you just being a casual observer of this and had no no further inquiry about it for anyone in the area whatsoever. Like I know we're in a quarantine, we needed to be staying away from people. But if it were me and someone else grabbed that hamster, I would have gone up to that woman and asked her what the fuck is going on. <laughs> no, she went toward she was going toward the Walmart workers and looking for a, a Walmart worker. So but it was someone so who didn't it was out of my hands. <laughs> Absolutely but I love that it's like I, as soon as it's out of your eye line, it's mm, like forget it. <laughs> the moment someone else comes in and says, "Let me protect this thing," mm, fine, have fun. You're you want to be the hero? You go be the hero. Like I wouldn't be. I'm able gonna go to save leave. money. <laughs> Personally, I wouldn't be able to leave that Walmart without some sort of explanation. You should go into a Walmart and see how badly you want to leave the moment you walk in. It takes oh, more yeah, than a hamster yeah. to keep I, you I wouldn't be going into a Walmart. It was like oxygen <laughs> tanks. Like, it hasn't changed at all. I, it, you know. Does it I'm still part- smell like pancake syrup in there? <laughs> <laughs> Every Walmart smells like waffle, like waffles or so. <laughs> yeah, it definitely had the Walmart stench. But. There's a Walmart in Joshua Tree, which um, it's like the you know, it's the only place to really stock up on all the alcohol that you need. But they had essentially uh, a McPrison because it was a McDonald's <laughs> jammed inside the Walmart. But then yeah. uh, late at night, they close off uh, like most of the entrance to it, and it's literally steel bars that come down to separate <laughs> like the checkout area from the McDonald's. And we happen to be. Um, coming down from psychedelics, uh, myself and about six <laughs> others, and we were like, we got to get foam swords and light up toys and some nuggets because we're going to go back to the house. So we should really stock up. Absolutely. And we wandered into the Walmart and we were at the counter ordering our nuggets as the steel bars began to descend. And I almost lost a good friend that day because <laughs> the panic and the neck scratching of the, are we going to be trapped in this <laughs> all day? <laughs> And also the casual drop of Mick Prison was fantastic. (laughs) Laughing, which added to the fear and paranoia of like, you all know something that I don't know. The bars are coming down. You're laughing at me. I feel trapped. We just want our 50 piece McNuggets. Um, It was- You were on, were you on psychedelics at the time or you were coming down? So you were kind of- We were, yeah, we were, I mean, we were, we were good enough to to commute to the Walmart to sort of go inside and handle the nugget purchase, at least the driver (laughs) was. Uh, My friend clearly was not. Yeah. And, um, you know, we missed the sunset that night. (laughs) (laughs) Wait, is that the McPrison that has the Guantanamo play place? (laughs) (laughs) Jesus Christ. I don't even know. 
Uh, yeah, you can form you can form a Mick pyramid with the hamburger <laughs> at the base. Uh, um, there's a there's a waterboarding station for yeah. kids. <laughs> Yeah, sweet and sour sauce. <laughs> Good God! All right. Well, uh, listen. We've we've nearly we've nearly killed an hour. 